Hello, this is Nick with NickScomputerFix.com and here's a video on how to adjust your sound settings within Windows 10. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. There's a few ways to get into your sound settings. One is to go down to your start menu and right click, scroll up the menu and click on the control panel and then go and look for sound and there it is right here on mine and left click on that and that open up the uh, sound window where you can make adjustments to your sound settings. I'm going to go ahead and close that. Now in some laptops and in mine they gave me a an additional uh, wizard that I can use for adjusting my um, audio settings and of course mine is called audio wizard. Yours might be called something else and you may not have one um, at all so uh, you may just have the icon sound so it all depends let's go ahead and close out the control panel now the other way to go into your sound settings is go down here and on the taskbar we can uh, left click and adjust the sound settings the volume um, for your speakers here and um, I'll leave it at 25 now you can also adjust your sound um, volume on your laptop keyboard and on mine and on a lot it's F10, F11, F12 using the function key and that will mute down and turn the volume up. Now back to the icon here on the taskbar right click and we can go and click on playback or uh, record devices or even sounds but first let's go ahead and open up a uh, volume mixer now this is where we can either simultaneously or separately uh, change the volume for um, those devices that show up in the mixer here. And let's go ahead and adjust those so that they're all balanced again and then come over here. And as you can see I can adjust them all at the same time. And I'll leave it right there. Okay. Um, at any rate there's another way to adjust things and let's close that out and go back to the uh, volume icon down here and this time we're just going to go ahead and open up uh, sounds and again that opens up the same sounds um, window that we would have uh, or we did open up in the control panel and if we click on um, playback we can see that my speakers is by default playing um, the sound for playback and this setting right here when I have my HDMI cable connected to my TV set I can play the sound coming out of my laptop um, through my TV speakers and of course I can adjust the levels um, and change the icon here and also uh, change the properties as well so if I go into levels, of course I can uh, adjust my Realtek um, HD audio uh, card um, to my liking. And I can also adjust the balance of my left and right speaker as well. I can either keep them the same or slightly off to get uh, the hearing or the audio that I prefer. Okay, um, let me go ahead and leave those at uh, uh, 100 and I'll move this back slightly a little bit and leave that right there and go into enhancements now in enhancements I can make some changes on the sound effects um, that the um, speakers are giving out um, so that um, if I wanted to hear my song or music in virtual sound I go ahead and click on this now you would have either the identical number of effects or even more depending on um, your particular configuration now under advanced I can change the um, sound quality that I'm listening to um, I can switch it over to oh let's see how about um, this one right here 44 nah, let's go 4800 um, studio quality and you can hear that on the test and I can go back over to this one and that's the 16-bit and you'd be hard-pressed to tell the difference really um, except for in the in your music or your song I'm sure you can tell the difference between um, you know the different quality of uh, you know uh, studio versus you know 24-bit studio versus 16 okay um, 
let's go ahead and click OK here and go up to uh, recording. Now I can um, adjust the internal and external um, microphones. Here I'm just going to adjust the internal and I can change the properties. I can use this device or don't use this device. Um, now under listen I can make some uh, adjustments here and uh, I can go down here and the default playback device can be changed um, as well. Now under levels I can adjust the sensitivity of the microphone um, so it's less sensitive to uh, picking up my voice or, or other sounds and far away I can either give, even give it a boost to be super sensitive. Okay, under enhancements I can make adjustments on the microphone here as well and uh, um, or I can disable sound effects completely. Now under advance I can change the um, format here and certainly I can change it to a selection of e any of those that I choose to. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and close this out because I don't want to change too much. And um, under sounds, um, this is for uh, sounds within Windows itself. You know, opening up email or getting calendar alerts uh, or, or text alerts or what have you. Or, uh, you know, Windows opening and shutting and you get different types of uh, sounds that you can adjust. For instance, on their calendar reminder. Um, I can go ahead and test that. Okay, and if I wanted to, I can change it to this one here, and it's, it's just a click. And uh, let's go ahead and change it again, and uh, that's that'd be a nice one. Very mellow. Okay, um, again, I can uh, change anything I like and um, make it different and I'm um, gonna put it back there we go and uh, that's the one I'm gonna leave it at alright once you make your changes you click on apply and if you don't want to make any changes you just say cancel alright uh, communications um, you can make some changes here and adjust um, a couple of items that you may or may not want to adjust alright um, that's just about it for this tutorial um, actually, it is it for this tutorial. I hope you got something out of this and um, be sure to subscribe and like my video.